five minutes. So I want to talk about the Harbaugh family for a second, Jim Harbaugh and John Harbaugh. Um, and it starts with this. Lincoln Riley is the hot coach this year. And the story came out this morning. Lincoln Riley doesn't want to coach in the NFL. Tweet. Lincoln Riley, contract extension, Oklahoma. So now we have eight NFL openings and exactly two coaches that if they got one of those openings, all fan bases would be excited. Mike McCarthy and Jim Harbaugh. If Jim Harbaugh got any of these eight jobs, Packers, Jets, Dolphins, Cardinals, Bucks, Browns, Broncos, Bengals, that fan base, ticket sales would increase. But all I hear about Jim Harbaugh, oh my God, that guy's overrated. He's winning nine and a half a year at Michigan. By the way, he rebuilt it for the first three years. Legendary Bo Schembechler in the 70s, 60s, won 9.2 a year. Fewer games. And it should be noted, that's in an era when there was far less competition and Michigan was one of about eight programs that had any money. Now everybody's got money, especially the Southern football powers. Jim's winning more games on average in a tougher environment. Scholarship limitations, Bo didn't face that, 9.5 to 9.2. And he is also, along with Mike McCarthy, in fact, even more so than Mike McCarthy, the only coach, it's basic economics, supply and demand, that if he got one of the eight coaching jobs, any of the eight, ticket sales would increase. If you think Jim Harbaugh got a job at Cleveland tomorrow, you don't think Brown fans would go nuts? They, go, they went nuts for finishing in third place this year. Cleveland fans went nuts for finishing in third. You don't think Harbaugh with Baker? That town would go crazy. Folks, do you know how economics work? Supply and demand. Jim makes seven million a year. Nick Saban makes close to ten. That's about right. Nick wins about three more games a year. A million a win. He's paid. Ex for, he's paid based on leverage. There are no great candidates. Jim Harbaugh is one, if not the only candidate, college or pro. That is a reasonable candidate that if he got the job, ticket sales would explode. That's how the game works. You are worth what your leverage is. Lincoln Riley's taken himself out of the jobs. Who's available? Who would get people excited? You don't think, you don't think Jet fans would like Harbaugh? You don't think Packer fans would like him? You don't think Brown fans would like him? This is how economics work. He's making $7 million at Michigan. For his leverage, that is exactly what he should make. He shouldn't make 10. That's what Saban makes. Let me talk about John Harbaugh for a second. John Harbaugh's name is everywhere. How's that possible? If I told you there was a coach who had a quarterback who started in week 11, went 6-1, and one, and now was going to host a playoff game, you'd think John Harbaugh, he never want to leave that job. Why is John Harbaugh's name everywhere? Because John Harbaugh is allowing his name to be everywhere. If John Harbaugh th thought this Lamar Jackson thing was 10 years sustainable, he would call his agent and say, take my name out of these jobs. The reason John Harbaugh's name is out there is because John Harbaugh privately has seen this sort of offense work briefly with his brother Jim. Jim got Colin Kaepernick, ran around, beat the Packers, beat Aaron Rodgers, got to a Super Bowl, and then never developed as a pocket quarterback because it wasn't his thing, wasn't his game. And Jim Harbaugh got fired. John Harbaugh's brother has lived the life he's living. So when you see John Harbaugh's name up, and it's up this morning for six jobs, is because what he's selling and what they're selling in Baltimore to the public is we are all in. The reality is they're saying, can we win like this for seven years? Uh, I don't know if we can win like this. Lamar might get hurt. So my little Harbaugh update. Jim is exactly paid based on leverage, based on the fact that if USC was looking for a coach today, the fans would ask for Harbaugh. The fans would want Harbaugh. The Packers want him. The Browns want him. The Jets want him. You're paid what your leverage is. Harbaugh is singularly, uniquely leveraged in college football right now. He can get the best college jobs. He can get the best pro jobs. He's paid exactly what he should pay for his leverage. And John Harbaugh's name is out there because deep down... He has questions about sustainability because he saw what his brother went through with a highly talented running quarterback who never quite developed into the kind of quarterback you could trust to throw 35 times a game. Joy with the news. No, 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 no. Turn on the news. This 
is the Herd Line News.